Hello, welcome to the Daily Political Tarot Readings here on the Black and Orange channel. Thank you so much for being here, and I, I do apologize for coming on late, uh, dragging <laughs> out. I, I did a live last night, uh, for anyone who didn't, didn't, didn't know, and I was on until 2. Couldn't finally get to bed till at 3, and uh, this may seem like a lot later, but Woke up early, the cat was nervous about the, the vacuum and elsewhere in the house. And yeah, so not a whole lot of sleep, but here we are. So I just want to let you know that your being here is very important to me and your questions are very, very important to me. So I have gathered those. Um, thank you. Thank you, Holly. I have, uh, I have quite, I've gathered 10 of your questions. I'll see if I can get through them. Usually I do 12. I'll see if I can, but um I'm getting a bit of a late start on Wednesdays. I've got a hard cutoff time at uh, 1.40. So thank you so much. Um, it's quite a day, isn't it? But we'll get through it. We'll get through it. Sleep is your friend, this is right. Yes, true, true. Uh, I did I did spend some quality time on the, the great chair of happiness with Boo Boo. So... And uh, last night I got to spend some wonderful quality time on sitting on a couch downstairs with Boo Boo on this side of me and, and Alfie on the other, Alfie and Bailey. It was very sweet. Anyway, so there's that. I'll get to your questions in just a second. Thank you guys. Thank you, Sherry. Today's nails. Just thought I'd go with some basic stuff today. And um, so you can see. Um, also, I told you guys I was going to get some merch and I was going to start making some merch, designing some stuff for merch, and that I was going to create a graphic, start just by creating one graphic and then trying different companies and w waiting to get product back from them to, to check the quality and the price and how easy or difficult it was. And uh, whew, I'm used to Amazon Prime, so uh, shipping is expensive. <laughs> but anyway, so um, I just wanted to to share that. Um, well, I mean, I might have something. It's hard to see in this light. But um, yeah, it's really hard to see in this light. You'll, you'll get a better view of it at some point. But um, I call this the cute kitty tarot. And there's the seven of pentacles right there. And at the bottom it says black and orange tarot and astrology. So this is my first piece of merch. This one is from Zazzle. I'd show you that it says Zazzle on the bottom, but... Um, Oh, thank you, Christine. Thank you. Um, so anyway, this is uh, this is the first piece of merch I've ever designed, and I, I've, I'm I'm thinking about making a whole deck of cute kitty tarot because it's uh, it's pretty fun. I wonder if I turn this on if that would help. Probably not, but yeah, it can't hurt. I did nothing. <laughs> there. It's a little better. You can see more of the blue and stuff. So anyway, I'm quite, quite, quite pleased. Of course, there are always things I want to change, but uh, this is a 15 ounce mug. I'm, I don't know why I'm telling you this, but this is a 15 ounce mug from, from Zazzle with a black interior. Uh, so it doesn't show coffee stains and stuff like that. So um, anyway, but this is my new toy. Electra, nice cup. Um, okay, loves the cup, great size too, good. Electra, nice cup, I want, but I've got too many cups. Oh, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I don't know that anybody's gonna buy any of this merch. I just I just thought, you know what? I make graphics, why don't I do something with it? So anyway. Ooh, Patsy needs a new cup. Okay. Just 
Matt of Boo-Boo's and Katie Cup with the Superman logo sounds good. Well, to some extent, that's why I chose the, the white and the orange kitties. Boo-Boo. Pumpkin. I would also like to have a black cat in there, too. For my Nick. He was no longer with us. But I had him for 20 years. He was my best friend. God, I love that cat. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, Mother Earth Tarot, please send me and my dad some good energy. We're going through a rough time at the moment. For Mother Earth Tarot, for everyone who is struggling, divine energy pour down into the world. Raise the vibration in everyone's lives. For health, for kindness, for happiness, for luck, good luck. And all the blessings that higher and higher vibrations bring to the world. Okay. I'm glad you like it. Oh, good, good. <laughs> Stephanie makes a great gift. Oh, this, this December, December 4th. Saturday, December 4th is the big day for stuff. And I think I saw somebody say, you make it, I'll buy it. Did I see that before I closed my eyes? Katie's saying she needs a new toilet. If you want to use a mug for that. Can't roller skate in a buffalo herd, but you can sure try if you got a mind to do it. Karen saying you make it all by. Thank you, Karen. Okay. Oh. oh, boy. There's just there's a lot of um, there's a lot of this really hard energy right now everywhere. Listen, maybe bookmarks and stickers too. Oh, I'll have to think about that. I hadn't thought of that. That sure. All right. So let me get started. We're about seven and a half minutes in. So let's say at eight minutes. Let's, why don't we just dig straight down into the muck, shall we? Put on your waders, everybody. Um, at the bottom of my list here, I actually have two questions I wanted to just mention quickly. One, Holly was asking, since her trip to Vietnam, uh, Vice, President, Vice President Harris hasn't really been seen. Is all okay with her? And Greg is also saying, in case I missed it, where is VP Harris? What is she doing? I haven't picked up anything negative, just that she's insanely busy. That I, I, I just keep, I just keep getting for her. Um, no, I understand, Katie. I was just joking. It was a bad joke, but I was just joking. <laughs> Deborah says this day blows thus far. <laughs> From midnight last night. So now, yeah, it's not been grand. Um, VP Harris is so busy that busy doesn't even, she doesn't have three seconds to breathe. So um, Dave, Dave's saying, you definitely went overtime yesterday. Yeah, I overslept. The neighbor woke me up with a cup of coffee. Ooh, she's getting more psychic. You did good. <laughs> Uh, Mother Earth, uh, let me see. I, 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 let me get through the 10 questions I have, and then if I, I still have time, um, I will definitely uh, be happy to read on what's going on with the DOJ. But uh, let, me, let me just start with, we're going to start with Mel Brooks. Not Mel Brooks. Mel Brooks is a lovely human being from everything I've heard, whose, whose son loves him very much, and he loves his son, and they, they were really cute little videos they did early in the pandemic of talking to each other through, you know, big plate glass windows and stuff. And um, that's Mel Brooks. This is Mo Brooks, as in Mo Awful. <laughs> oh my gosh, Karen, thank you. Thank you. That is very kind. Thank you. Yes, it is going to be okay. There are good days ahead. There are. So, um, thank you. Wow. 
Okay. So Mo Brooks, not the lovely Mel Brooks, but Mo Brooks, Mo Awful. Mo Brooks belly aches about Congress seizing his phone records. Quote, they should not have access to anything. Mo, are you nervous? Do you have reason to be nervous? Okay, the cards are coming straight off the bottom of the deck, which means nefarious things afoot usually. Okay. Mo Brooks, oh, fighting for the Republican cause. Mm -hmm. King of Swords, Page of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Page of Cups. Um, I wouldn't call them full-blown fractures yet in the Republican Party between the far right and the more moderate Republicans, but there's, there's starting to be a looking around of which are you, how deep are you involved? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Mo Brooks. Nice uh, bulletproof vest you had on there. But no, you weren't trying to start any trouble. Oh, Brooks, they shouldn't have access to anything. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and didn't Gates come out and say something about, oh, excuse me. Sorry, didn't Gates, uh, Kristen from Uncover the News, which is who's bringing us amazing headlines. Uh, didn't you find Gates saying something about, well, he's going to try to get hold of Pelosi's phone records. Wow. You're as smart as a Bob's big boy plastic statue too, aren't you? Mo Brooks. He thinks he can do anything. He thinks he can get away because he, because he gets away with everything. Oh, thank you, Thalma. Thank you. Thank you. It means a lot. Thank you. Guys are so kind. Empress Hierophant. Yes, government's supposed to work for the people. Imagine that. Uh, and not blowing smoke. Queen of Cups. Oh, Mo. Darling. Um. This is our government. Our government is supposed to work for us. Try is supposed to help us. It's supposed to warn us when there's an actual pandemic. Help us get vaccines. Help us social distance to save lives. That's what government's supposed to do. They're supposed to be there to help us. That's why we pay taxes. This is just smoke and mirrors and garbage that the the Democrats are trying to, to work their way through to figure out how deeply these people were involved on January 6th. And this, my friends, right here, this is the card of evidence. People come in, they leave evidence, they leave. People, another someone else comes in, leaves, ev take, leaves evidence, leaves. He has reason to be worried. But he just thinks, like a lot of them, I do what I want. Uh, 
I mean, that's one of the it's one of the hardest things of is if I I did in the last couple of years was trying to explain to someone significantly younger than I am, like 25, 30 years younger than I am, that if if there's a a man uh, breaking up a marriage, so, you know, breaking up somebody's marriage because he wants a fling or whatever, that that's not good. And this person was like, but you should, you should do what you want. You should, you know, and I, I had to explain not only the whole thing about keeping your word, if you're not going to keep your word, don't give it. If you give it, you keep it. You work, you work, you clean up your mess before you move on. Anyway, but the hardest thing to describe was why socially you socially you have to call out as many of these men specifically men as you can because traditionally because of because of this patriarchy we're in traditionally there was no other recourse the social shaming was literally, I mean, they, 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 rich white men would do anything they wanted. And if you did not socially draw lines, at least at the very, like the bars, like this far off the ground, I mean, low bar, if you weren't even willing to do that, and if now you're saying, well, it's a free for all. It's like you're not you're not even going to do that. I was trying to explain why these older, not all, of course, but these older rich white men, why uh, quite a few of them, you don't want to know what they're going to turn into. You don't want to be there for that. They there needs to be social. They need to be. It, it is it is you need to act like part of the community you have been given you because of the patriarchy you have a place of prominence i don't think you deserve it but that's what you've got you have responsibilities and trying to explain that just and it's like yeah well let's get rid of the patriarchy then and then there was some argument about there's not really a patriarchy and then it was like okay we're done <laughs> we're done here Okay, sorry, I need to turn on the fan. It's kind of hot in here. Dave's saying there's a big difference between marriage and dating. I avoid married women like the plague. Smart. You may live longer, too. Yeah, and the stories about what some people will do to. Um, the significant other. No, sorry, who will do to the significant other the person they're having the affair with? Wow. Yeah, just don't don't wade into those waters. <sighs> Thank you, Marby. Thank you. Thank you. There's Kristen with Uncover the News. Just bringing us all the great headlines. Okay, Mrs. Betty Bowers, she's great. Is it is it her, the tagline the world's best Christian? Funny. On Twitter, highly recommended. All right, we are at nineteen thirty. So now, Kristen was kind enough to share that our, our, uh, the ex, the ex Fiora, <coughs> sorry, um, our, our, our ex Fiora, uh, has said Trump, okay, uh, let's see, news, Trump rages at Dominion lawsuits with profane rant. They're trying to silence people. Why is Trump worried? 
Oh, Holly, uh, Betty Bowers is also on YouTube. Cool. Um, why is Trump worried about the Dominion lawsuit? He's not named in them to the best of my knowledge, is he? Everything I looked, I've, I've searched, I looked. It was all Trump's allies. Trump's allies. It's not, Dominion isn't going out directly after Trump. Just shuffle on my my leg here. I can't shuffle on this. I, I moved my planner. It's over there. And this, uh, if I shuffle on this tabletop, the standing desktop, it'll be really loud. Um, so at 20... Now let's just say 2130. So Trump is raging about the Dominion lawsuits. Where are you, Trump? Where are you, Sniffy? He feels irrelevant. Oh, happy day. <laughs> I'm reading on I'm reading on Trump's energy and he's feeling irrelevant. So, why are you all bent out of shape about the Dominion? Lawsuits doesn't have anything to do with you, does it? Uh, Sherry's saying for years I tried to explain white privilege to my son who just didn't get it. Until he witnessed firsthand his girlfriend's reaction to being pulled over by the cops and her abject fear of them. She was brown skinned. Yep. Trump. Oh, he's he he's still trying to um, he's trying to distract himself from all the lawsuit stuff. He's still thinking about he's gonna be he's gonna be be 45 and 47, the bigliest present president ever. Four of Pentacles. Oh, he's also desperate to raise money. Do you think he's raised millions? But no, he owes millions. That's the problem. So I my financial situation is a giant bucket with a giant hole in it. So pour more money into this hole, into the bucket, I mean so that I can be rich. Meanwhile, I'm underwater and the money's just pouring out from all the debts I have. Queen of Cups, Queen of Pentacles. Oh, that's interesting. I get Queens for groups. These are the Democrats. These are the Republicans. And it feels like they're both starting to align against him and his political future <laughs> sorry just the best way i could describe it uh gail saying in march hey gail in march dominion lawyer stated they've not ruled out suing trump directly because he's not going to get uh he's 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 got he's got he's got money problems. He's got legal problems for breaking laws. He's got um, various of those. So we've got money issues, legal issues, and political issues. Are people still walking out of his uh, rallies forty minutes early, looking just ignoring him on the loudspeaker?
Holly and Francis saying his debt ratio is abysmal. Mm hmm. Exactly. So, are you going to get uh, sued? Ian, it's nice to see you coming out of your shell. 10 out of 10. Thank you. Thank you. Well, thank you, Fi. Um, so, is Dominion going to come after you, Trump? Oh, I have a cup of chamomile. Chamomile tea. Because his blood pressure, which was already pretty ugly, is going to go up. Total irrelevance. I can't drink chamomile tea. I can't even smell it. It sets off my, my allergies. <laughs> Trumpy's tower is falling down. Falling down, falling down, metaphorically falling down. Bye bye, Trumpy. Oh, they might go after him. Who will get the popcorn? And it's small potatoes. With the, the, the grief and legal stuff he's facing and going to be facing, uh, pff, the Dominion thing is small. Even if they say they want to, you know, one billion dollars. Oh, good. I'm glad, Cam. Okay, Nelson, hit it, baby, one more time. <laughs> Good, good, good. Yoy. Um, small potatoes. So Katie's got to get ready for work. Good luck. Good luck. Be safe. Take a sweater. Be home by 10. <laughs> I got a moon in cancer. What do you expect? All right. So we're at 28 and a bit. We haven't looked at Trumpy in a while. I thought it was kind of nice to take the time to do that. 20, let's say 2830. McCarthy. So McCarthy is another one having... Uh, stomping, stomping his widow feet this morning. McCarthy is threatening tech and telecom firms that to comply with the January 6th committee's request to retain information. That's comply. Oh, no. My mistake. McCarthy threatens tech and telecom firms that comply with January 6th committee's request to retain information related to the attack. He's saying, you know, we'll remember and really, so will McCarthy do anything? Is McCarthy going to actually do something? Speaker of the house. <laughs> McCarthy, where are you? He's going to squeam and squeam and squeam until he's thick. Dave's saying lots of people think Sniffy Jr. will be the first to be indicted. I put some money in a pool. I bet it'll be, in, it will, he will be indicted in October, hopefully on my birthday. <laughs> oh, th thank you, Irma. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. <sighs> McCarthy. 
He's gonna he's gonna stomp his little feet. Oops, sorry, sorry. So McCarthy, you're gonna go after those big old tech companies. Justice. Knight of Wands. We packed the courts. How dare you use the courts? We own the courts. Oh, we've got both knights of the, the, the Republicans and the far right. Trump's base of power. Running, it feels like he's running back to Trump. Might be Trump's playbook, or maybe he is. Literally, didn't he go visit Trump? But this is coming out of good things of good legal standing. Gonna go try, go crying to Daddy Trump, are you? Chris is saying, why is McCarthy not dealing with Madison Cawthorn? Because he agrees with him. Deal with them how? Tell them not to spout far right dangerous rhetoric. And and that's nothing negative about you, Chris. I, I'm just it's just the self situation is infuriating. Probably want to can Trump go lower? We well, can't really see lower between the girdle and the ill-fitting suits and the tie. You can't really see anything. Yeah, threats of violence. Yes, you don't see McCarthy coming out and saying. Marjorie Trader Green does similar things. So I've just got McCarthy running, running, you know, stomping his widow feet and uh, running back to, to Daddy Trump. Queen of Swords. They're they're but they're gonna, they're gonna get the records. The the insurrection, it's gonna come out. Who talked to to what when during the insurrection? This whole attempted coup, we're going to learn a lot, a lot. This is not going to be one of those held accountable in theory only kind of situations. No, this is, this is going to be the real deal. So anyway, all right. Uh, Tolly one day, if Trump's girdle let loose, would his feet disappear? I, I try not to think about it. Um, and it, is, it has nothing to do with his weight. It's the fact that he's a fathead. <laughs> Actually, it reminds me of something, a very funny comedian. I wish I, I wish I could remember. If you could, if you know the comedian, let me know, because I quote this all the time. I think about it all the time. There was a comedian who was saying that the problem with us gaining weight isn't that, you know, it's not, I mean, we know it's not good for us and what have you. The problem is we gain weight in really convenient places. Now, if we gained weight, like just on our foreheads and it would be like, Oh man, I need to start hitting the gym. We'd lose weight, but it's nice conveniently. So you can still move around and <laughs> so fat head jump. All right. Uncover the news. Ah, oh, news. Text messages reveal that Trump was looking to bankroll Arizona election audit. Trump part with money. Really? Thank you, Mimi. All right. McCarthy's McCarthy. 35. All right. Uh, this, this reminds me of the other question I, I copied down, but I, there are any number of questions here about this ruling that came through, uh, went into, 
into place, basically the, the law that went into place at midnight in Texas. I did a whole, I came on it one in the morning and did a whole reading on it. Um, multiple readings on it. There's only so much of this I can read on before it's it's too much. And I know that makes me a wuss, but um, I know their readers, they're just like, they're on it, they're on it, it's no problem, they just do the, I don't know why, it just, it gets to me. So certain dark topics, I just, I can only handle so much. And so I'm reading very various questions on this. Um, this issue, I've got like three, four questions here on it might be five questions on it. So by the time I got down to Paula's question, which is currently the, the last question listed uh, in the description, I won't say it out loud. It's just, I, I can't go there. So Mandy says, I felt your energy all morning. Oh gosh, I hope it wasn't that bad. Uh, yeah, it's, I Paula, I just, I, I can't go there. But I'm, we're going to read on this. It's, it's. I'm sorry to be a wuss, but I, there are just some places I just can't go energetically, and then we're already, we're already going to walk around this subject, or, or walk. We're going to walk around this, this subject with some space down into it. <clears throat> okay. So, Kristen from Uncover the News. Thank you, Andy. I feel badly for you. Oh, I'll be okay. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. It's, it's women in general I'm worried about. So, um, thank you, Mara. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Um, so Biden rips extreme new Texas abortion law. Okay. So I want to know, is he going to do anything about it? Anything substantial? Substantial. So definitely wanted to look at that. Whew. Anne says, I felt your energy on the West Coast. I'll be at time delayed. I woke up at 1 a.m., saw your post, and fall back to sleep until 4. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, gosh, I didn't mean to keep you guys up. Polly Wanda, I treat my extra pounds like friends and often take them to the restaurant. <laughs> okay. Floating Lotus saying, maybe this will push Biden toward appointing extra justices. I read on that over and over last night, and I just kept getting getting weird. Like, Biden's going to... I, I've got at least one person going through confirmation. It's a woman at some time that Biden's taking care of it. But no matter what I did, I tried 13. Will we go up to 13 justices? Will we, will we go to 11? Will we, I mean, there are 13 districts and some people are doubled up. So 13 would make sense, but. All right, Uncle Joe. You can actually do something about this. Other than just talk. Talk, 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 talk. Thank you, Fi. Good question, Pegasus. Anyone know what it takes to create two new justices, congressional law? I don't, I don't know. All right, Uncle Joe. And for anyone who's, um, Ed, Ed, I agree with you, Dems need to play hardball on all matters. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, the Texas law that went, came into effect last night at midnight, it bans all, all, abortions at six weeks before most women even know they're pregnant. There are no exceptions. 
There are no exceptions for incest, for the R word. No exceptions. Uncle Joe, do something. There's an emergency medical exception, but that's it. But 12 year old girl gets attacked. Oh, well. Ten of Swords. Seven of Swords. Three of Wands. Hanged Man. King of Pentacles. This is what the... The people on the far right, they... You know, they've been keep, they've been bringing these suits for years, over and over and over, different places, different, trying to get Roe v. Wade overturned. And they haven't had a whole lot of luck, but they, with this court, they finally found a way, and the court didn't even rule on it. They didn't have a hearing and what, no, they just declined to take it up. So the lower thing stands. Thief in the Night. This is the, uh, these far right Republicans is that I get wands, cups for Democrats, pentacles for uh, Republicans and wands for these neo-Nazis. And I'm calling them what they are, they're fascists. Um, wands for the fascists. They've been putting things out, throwing stuff at the wall, sending things out, wondering, waiting for their ship to come in. But here is a major arcana hanged man. This is a suspension. And this is King of Pentacles. These are the Republicans, the big male energy silverback gorillas in uh, Congress who push this kind of stuff and who, who drag their knuckles to work every morning. But this is a suspension. What's the, so what, so Uncle Joe, what are you doing about this suspension thing? Is that because of you? Or other, I mean, I wouldn't think other courts would step in, but. What are other people getting on this? Because it's usually, it's it's no, I, I like that probably one to keep our privates privatized. Exactly. Um. It's usually that no reader is 100% accurate. It's usually a consensus among readers is usually what's most likely to happen. Uh, so have you been, if other readers been on this morning, I, I wasn't able to see. Charlie says you can't get them to rid of, get rid of the filibuster. I think they'll expand the court. I hear you. I've, I've been not getting great cards. I, I'm not getting clear energy. All right. What's that suspension about? What is that suspension? This this lies in, so something about this isn't going to stand. Something something about this legally is going it's going to be suspended, stopped. There's there's something that stops it. I I got this card a lot last night. Michelle, don't want to be the bearer of bad news, but also places a $10,000 bounty on the heads of suspected women. Yes, yes, thank you for reminding me, Michelle. I've forgotten to mention that. A $10,000 bounty. I think it's on providers. Technically, it's not on the women. It's on the providers, I believe, but... Four of Pentacles. We may be stuck in the Senate with Mansion and Cinema being. Anyway, you know what they're like. But we, but the Democratic Party, is them is 
has the presidency and technically is in charge of all three, sorry, of, of both branches of Congress. Republicans should not have a say here. They shouldn't have the power to do or stop anything, but Ace of Pentacles. There's a lot of money flowing in. Nine of Wands, Knight of Wands, Queen of Pentacles. I keep just I keep just getting Republican stuff. I get all this kind of stuff on the periphery of the law being suspended, of, of happy democratic families, of, but it's on the periphery. And then the readings themselves over and over. Republicans don't have the power, but this is a push button issue. So they, they think this gives them power, but the, the fascist far right is feeling very beaten up um, and they're actually losing power, which is why they're going more and more extreme and they're trying to drag more moderate Republicans with them. I just keep getting this over and oh, I keep getting these same cards over and over. Am I mis am I am I misinterpreting things? It doesn't feel like it. So something step it I think something somebody somewhere is gonna step in. One last chance. Come on, Joe. Come on, Jack. Do something. Come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. Happy Democratic families. Oh, ACL, ACLU, all the, there, oh. Just, there's, there is, there's not only, uh, burnt rubber on the road between the ACLU office and uh, the nearest courthouse. It, it, it's still, it's still flaming. Page of swords, four of cups. But they're going to have some, they're going to have some, some hurdles in the courts. Certain judges are going to get in the way of, of, trying to reinstate decency. Are any of you readers? I know some of you are. Charlie is saying, Autumn, Linda G said the same thing, it won't hold up. Okay, okay, thank you. Electra Storm saying, Joe can only do something if all the Dems are on board and we don't have that. Mm-hmm. Helen Sweet, maybe not mention his brother is having legal troubles, strong troubles. Oh, okay. Unbelievable. Pegasus, the ACLU is already on it. Unbelievable. All right. That went on for a long time, but here we are, 49. This is a kind of a, I got, I combined two questions. Okay. This is from both Polly Wanda and then Leah, both had similar questions. Will the Texas Taliban spread oppression to other states? Polly Wanda asked. Leah asked, will Florida go the same way as Texas regarding abortions? Death Santis is a nut job too. So let's just start with Florida. Because I would think it would be if if someone said, okay, this is going to spread somewhere, where's it going to spread first? My guess would be Oklahoma. Um Some somewhere like 
Well, if the Florida would definitely be on the mark. Yes, Mississippi, Arkansas. I was kind of thinking through that, but um, let's look at Florida. So is this kind of absolute cruel garbage going to um, spread to Florida? Will this be the new the new thing they're going to do in Florida? And at that point, her entire head burst into flames. Get the marshmallows, kids. Get. The black and orange channel, her head burst into flames. Florida. Gives whole new meaning to Florida man, doesn't it? Judgment. And DeSantis has shown such stellar judgment thus far. <laughs> My countrymen and women, but especially certain men, have lost their blank minds. Eight, yes, hem women in. Yep. Eight of Swords, Queen of Cups. Ooh, nine of cups. Ooh, nine of wands. Sorry, seven of wands. Queen of pentacles. Oh, they're they're, they're going to try. They'll they'll try something to try to hem this in. But this is women coming together and allies coming together and saying, "Oh no." Mm -mm. Whether it's in the legislature or it's taking to the streets or it's whatever, but it puts these fascists back on their heels in defense. And then, of course, there's Death Santis just overseeing the field. Yeah, women are not going to take this. Mm -mm. Nope. Oh, nay, nay. Oh, nay, nay. So Florida, I think they're going to try. Michelle, Texas Taliban, super appropriate. Uh, that was good. But honestly, I would expect nothing less from Polly Wanda, who I sincerely suspect is an actual literal genius. <sighs> okay. Uh, so what about other states? We're at 53. Let's say 53.30. Oh, boy. What about other states? So is the Texas fascism going to spread this particular form of fascism? The, the thing I got last night when I did all those readings, I did the last reading, which was looking for a message for us. And the, one of the main things, and, and the message for us really was, as bad as this is, it is only one piece of the overall picture. And the overall picture is that these fascists, their days are numbered. We do have to fight legally, ethically, but there are actually, there, there have been so many improvements and we're not gonna give those improvements up. We're just not. Oh, more favor, please. Thank you. Uh, they're not available yet, but uh, I'm going to try a couple more um, places uh, to see, check quality and price and stuff. So. Texas. Mm -hmm. So is this garbage going to spread to Texas? Sorry, to spread from Texas into other U.S. states. You can, I, I can, I can, I can hear the 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 plague rats scurrying. To, um, I can feel the the, the fascists in state legislatures just scurrying to get similar things onto their floor and get them passed. Special sessions.
they're going to try. Oh, this is their chance to get back in the good graces of uh, evangelicals after um, the Trump stuff. They're not understanding there are fewer and fewer evangelicals. They're not the force that they once were. They're a force, but they're not the force that they were. Page of Cups, Ace of Swords, King of Pentacles, the states with majority Republican legislatures, especially those with big majorities. But this is partnership and medical care. This is this is good energy. This is good energy, but it's being hemmed in. They're, they're going to be able to, yes, there are going to be other restrictions passed in various states before this ends, or there are or certainly proposed, because this is partnership, decisions made, this is consent, this is uh, medical care, this is relations between, you know, the, the two, two bits of, the two bits of things you need to come together in order to form a baby. Um, but it's being hemmed in by Republicans and um, the fascists. The sort of truth is there. It's a very emotional concept. Penny's asking, why did conservative churches once want many of these laws? Control. Why wouldn't why wouldn't the, why doesn't the Catholic Church allow women priests? If that doesn't tell you everything you need to know right there about their view of women, I don't know what does. And I was raised Catholic. My whole family is still Catholic, except for me. Mary's saying, I saw this tweet. A virus has more reproductive rights than women. Uh, Michelle saying it's the state flying monkeys. State of flying monkeys? State. I'm sorry. I, I didn't. What am I missing? I'm being dense about something. Sorry. Deba, China ran out of women. Too many lonely men. Limited the number of children they could have to one. So they just got rid of many of the baby girls as they possibly could. And now they have the surplus of men. Fifty-nine. Got that. All right. Fifty-nine. Oh, my head is... Okay. Count viral. I like that. Will the Democrats maintain control of the House after the 2022 elections? Chris is asking, what is the ACLU? Oh. They, they, their civil right, they're a, correct me if I'm wrong, non, non-profit, but they, they fight for civil rights. They're, that's their thing. That's their big thing. Um, American Civil Liberties Union, I believe. Okay. Let's have the let's have a look at the uh, all the Democrats making maintain control of the House um, House of Representatives. The Democrats Justice card is popping up, and I keep getting this. I've been getting this consistently all along. That there are legal things that come out and there are so many of them that come out they have come out this year people are indicted this year the 
um, trials are next year, all the way up to election day. And by that point, just people are just so fed up. It's like if you're if, if you if you are a Republican politician, it's just like, what did you do? Point Polywanda, Texas, Texas bounty hunters hunting women, ten thousand dollars per head. Ugh, Pegasus saying the biggest shoes have yet to drop. I, I, I think they're definitely more coming. Oh, so nice, such nice energy. The women who are in power, like our vice president, like our speaker of the house, like. All of the all of the the women of decency and conscience. Hey, okay. All right, seven of cups, three of wands, four of swords. The world. I need some clarification here. I think I'm gonna, I need some clarification here. World and Shad the Hanged Man. Will Democrats maintain control of the House of Representatives after the 2022 election? Will they still be in power in February 2023? It's going to be very emotional. There's going to be a lot of emotional upheaval in 2022. Justice, fruits of labor, secrets, justice about secret fruits of labor, Republican fruits of labor, incredible upset, same cards I always get on this, same cards, same cards, same cards, that's what I'm getting, all right, still have some time here at 104, where are we? Um, okay, let's let's look at Paula's question about. Well, she it wasn't really a question, but she brought up where is this, sorry one of four. So Paula was uh, kind, Paula was kind enough to bring up this idea that Texas law now, now allows private citizens to sue anyone who aids or abets abortions. How will this play out in frivolous lawsuits by sue-happy snitching opportunists looking to make $10,000 plus dollars, $10,000 or more? So we need to look at the Texas bounty Polly Wanda Sage by the truckload. The Texas bounty on those aiding women. It's it's good. I don't like candles because I, I can't handle the smoke. I have aller I have allergies to dust and to pollen and smoke. I love, you know, the lovely roaring fire. I just can't smell it for too long. <laughs> um, 
but boy, I just, I could light, I've got a, I've got a candle sitting over here. I could probably light it just by touching it right now. So the Texas bounty against those who are helping women. I'm sure this will be a wonderful idea. What could go wrong? Two cards for the reading. Bullies. This is women. This, this sends a very clear message to really bad men. And there are some really bad men out there. Not saying women are perfect, but this is the topic we're talking about. And this is a woman not having as much agency, being bullied about symbolic things. Sorry. Sorry, I didn't mean to deafen you. Just slipped out of my hand. Sorry about that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry. Yes, they have a hotline. Thank you, Paula. For women, mothers. Oh, just looking for that. Just watching every woman who might be pregnant. Have you heard anything? Have you? Oh, yes. Protect the children. Uh, this is this really undermining Republicans to women voters. This is female judges saying, oh, nay, nay. But there's going to be a lot of bullying and there's going to be a lot of pain with this law even being in place for the last 13 hours. Okay. Is there more on this particular topic? I'm so far down deep in the mud. It's just like, there are there more questions? <laughs> All right. Get some of the mud out of my eyes. We're so far down deep in the muck. We're at 109. Uh, Jill was saying she thinks that it's possible Samuel, Samuel Alito, who oversees the U.S. Circuit Court of Appeals, that Texas might be his doing? Do we know that? I'm, I'm really limited on time today. Um, you know what, I'm gonna have to wait on that. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Jill. I'm gonna look at Cecilia's question. Will Lauren, Lauren Boebert be indicted and prosecuted for assisting the insurrectionists? Let's just have a look at that. And that's gonna do it for me for today. But let, and I'm sorry, oh, nay, nay. Well, we can look at Canada tomorrow. Just, just put the question back in the chat. I do feel bad when I don't read on your questions, but sometimes I can't. All right, 109.30. Lauren Boebert. Oh, you Okay. Mary's saying people have been spamming the website with Shrek memes. What website? I, I, that sounds interesting, but I don't know what website or what exactly we're talking about. Or what specific Shrek means. My nose is itching. Right on the tip. Right there. Thank you, Onene. Thank you. Lauren Bobert. Where are you? Okay. 
got a weird metallic taste in my mouth when I read on her. Oh. So the website to report suspected abortions in Texas. Ten of Pentacles. So oh, she's part of the dynasty that that Republican. They still call themselves Republican, but she's one of the she's one of the fascists. She just is. She just is. Fascism is as fascism does. Nine of Swords. Seven of Cups. Hanged Man. Hello, Chad. Hanging Chad. Page of Wands. Devil. Ooh, somebody's in trouble. Someone is worried about going to uh, jail, prison. Someone's worried about some legal action lies. Absolutely. Oh, are you actually going to lie to prosecutors and, and people at hearings? Worrying because of the lying. This is a suspension. This is being strung up by your heels for messages, low vibration, devilish, awful messages. Hey, Chad, why are you here? What's up, Chad? Hmm? Oh, uncover the Kristen. I'm afraid I, I won't be able to get to that today. I'm sorry. But thank you so much for all of your great headlines and everything. Thank you. All right, Wilbert. She's in, she's in trouble. Lauren Bober, is she going to lose her seat? I don't like when the cards are, It's it looks too good to be true. Oh, great orange orangutan. Queen of Wands, Page of Swords, Ten of Cups. She, from her position of power, she's trying to bully her way through, but it ends in happy democratic families. Happy liberal families. There's a suspension right in the middle. She's going to get caught. She's going to get, they, they're going to have evidence of what she did. Some things that she did that she should not have been doing. I do hate to go because um, I, I only got to like eight, nine, nine questions, but uh, I'm afraid on Wednesdays I've got a hard cut off time. But thank you so much for being here. Um, thank you. I really appreciate it. And uh, I will be back tomorrow, definitely. Um, at four o'clock uh, today, I'm going to do my best to be over at Book Art Media, which is the parent company. It's my little publishing enterprise and um this is part of it book art media is a part of book art media oh, sorry black and orange is a part of book art media and uh, so i'll be over on the book art media channel at four o'clock bring your creative endeavors doesn't matter what it is we take uh we do four 25 minute uh just blocks of time and then we just encourage each other in during the quick breaks between each one and we just make we just make progress on bringing some creative energy into the world and, and expressing ourselves in our knitting, writing, painting, graphics. We talk about um, business art too sometimes. So, um, all right. I agree, Nanette. Uh, stay calm. This too shall pass. Yes. Hang in there, everybody. There are good days ahead. There are, I promise. I will see you this afternoon over at Book Art Media, or I will see you tomorrow. All right, take care. Thank you, Thaumla. Thank you. Take care.